At the end of the Cold War, there were major revolutions in the aerial combat technology. The most visible one was stealth bombers, and the second revolution was air to air missile, where the active radar homing missile began to replace the semi active radar missiles. Semi active missiles have a lot of limitation. The missiles only have a receiver and require the launching aircraft to use its own radar to designate an enemy aircraft for the missile to engage, so the launching aircraft must keep its radar pointed at the enemy aircraft. If an aircraft is destroyed or the launching aircraft is forced to maneuver by other missiles or aircraft, then the missile will break lock and go dumb. On the other hand, an ARH missile seeker has its own radar transmitter to accompany a receiver. The aircraft can be free to maneuver after launching a missile at enemy aircraft as the missile will fly until it goes pitbull, activating its seeker and homing in on the aircraft by itself. The first real operational ARH missile was the AIM-54 Phoenix to defeat Soviet bomber fleets before they could launch their anti-ship cruise missiles 